Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today I will be showing you how to multiply any number by 11. So let's get started. So first things first, I could do 49 times 11. We'll start with the two digit number. 49 times 11. So there are two methods of this. So I'll show you the second method right after I'm done with the first. So the first method is this. So whatever your first and last digit number is, you put that. So four and nine are my first and last digits. Second, I add these two numbers. And then after I add them, so if I add these two numbers, I get 13. I put the three here, I carry the one, and then this actually becomes a five. So the answer is 539. This is one way of doing it. The second way of doing it is if you do four and nine, and well, 40, another way of doing 49 times 11 is if you just write the number 400, I mean 490. So 49, and then you just add the zero, 490. And then you add the original number, which was 49. So you add these two and you get 539. So you can use this to verify or you can use this to solve it, either one. So now, with that being said, we can move on to a three-digit number. A three-digit number could mean 987. Sorry, 918. So 918 times 11. Um, this is far more complicated than the, the two-digit number. But here's how we do it. So every time you, every, um, any type of digit, you have to put the first and last digit. Even if it's like a six digit number, a seven digit number, you have to put the first and last. That's how you do it. And then you add. So instead of adding eight or nine or one and nine, you add eight plus one. That's nine. Then you add one plus nine, that's a 10. So this becomes a zero and this, you carry that one. So the answer is 10,098. And the other way is just simpler. You just add the zero in the back and then you just put the regular number. So we did a three digit number, now we can go into a fourth, four digit number. I could do nine, eight, seven, six times 11. So I can do, so um, this is the same thing. I'm just, it's more way like you have to, you can't do mental math properly that much in this. So you have to use paper. So what you do, as usual, put the first and last digits. Then you add these two numbers, these two numbers, and these two numbers. So seven plus six is 13, I carry the one. Seven plus eight is 15, so 15 plus one is 16, so I carry another one, and eight plus nine is 17. 17 plus one is 18. So I do the eight, and I carry this one, this becomes a 10. So the answer is 108,636. So this is our easy logic. These are the easy logics. And the most easiest of them all is just adding a zero on the back and then adding its number itself. It's simple. So 108,600. Now that we finished learning how to multiply a two digit, a three digit, and a four digit number by 11, you can feel free to um, multiply any digit number. So like you can do a seven digit, an eight digit, a nine digit, maybe even a 10 digit. So you can feel free to do that and uh, with the two methods. And I hope you like this video. Thanks for watching.